Hi, Leo. Welcome to November 2023. My name is Tisa. I'm also known as Sith Star 555. It's really nice to meet you. We're here right now looking into this month. Now, everything that you need to know about me is be right down below in the description box. Thank you so much for all of your love and your support. Let's see what we have going down right here. This is Leo in the month of November. I'm going to get a few kickoff messages here and then we'll use the traditional as well, tarot as well and get a message right here for you. So this is Leo, please. In the month of November 2023, please for Leo. Okay, $40,000, what a way to kick it off, okay? So, let's see here. Let's see if I can get it off here. $40,000. Okay, let me see what I can get right here for Leo. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, Leo in November 2023. Secret House. Okay, one more card, please, for Leo. And let's see what we have here. In the month of November for Leo, please. Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and North Node. We have right here, learning about skin conditions right here. Clear skin and a dermatologist right here. Okay. So that's like three different topics that's going on right here. Okay, so for some of you, I see a secret house for some of you right here. All right. I also see you figuring out about how to clear your skin or maybe you're helping somebody else clear their skin could be the case. And then I see some cash here as well. So this is really, really good for November. OK, let's see what the other cards bring out in this message, because this is just a kickoff here. What's going down surrounding the sign of Leo in November. OK, 2023. Holy Spirit, Holy Angel, this is Leo. OK, that's my puppy. Sorry for that, you guys. Anyway, Leo, let's see here. What's the message here, Leo? Queen of Cups, okay. Very stable this month, I feel. Yeah, very, very stable this month. Very loving, very caring. Okay, we're here, Queen of Cups. What else is going on? Oh, my. <laughs> okay, so I got way too many cards here, right? Way too many. So let me just go ahead and shuffle this again here. This is Leo, end of month of November 2023. Nine of Cups, the Wish card right here. Okay. I have a whole lot of cards flipping out here. Alright. What's your message right here, please? Leo. Hello, Leo. Allow me to be the channel, please, for Leo. Knight of Pentacles right here. Alright, Knight of Pentacles is about somebody being very thorough, very realistic right here. Sitting here at the moment, really looking at everything here some way. Okay, yeah. Making practical decisions right here. Okay, yeah. So, okay, this is really looking good so far. Okay, so I feel life is good. You know, you have to be realistic. You have to make practical decisions. I feel like something is stable right here for you right now. Okay. What else is going on here for Leo's, please? Allow me to be the channel, please. This is Leo in the month of November. The world card right here. Okay, so you get a new cycle right here. Yeah. Definitely get a new cycle of something here being very caring, I feel. And loving and stability. Okay. Six of Pentacles right here. It is a card of giving and receiving. I feel like something here is wish fulfillment financially, I feel. Okay. What's the message right here, please? This is Leo. So I feel like some of you, you, you're giving to somebody, you're giving money to somebody, you're making their day. Okay, for so some of you, all right, this could be somebody giving you money. So it could go either way like that, okay? Yeah, the empress right here reverse. Hmm. See, the empress reverse is um unable to create. Could be the case. Empress reverse. I'm unable to create. All right. If you're not unable, if, I feel like this was in the past. If you wasn't unable to create, all right, I feel like with the world card, make you feel like it was the past. So in the past, you was unable to create, and I feel like now you will because the world is about a beautiful new cycle. As we complete one old cycle, a new one begins here, okay? So I feel like stability is coming here. I feel like something's with fulfillment financially, okay? The Empress reverse right here. Maybe something here wasn't moving before. It definitely wasn't, I feel. Um, but I feel like it's going to start moving now for some people. Yeah. Okay. Seven of cups right here. 
Okay, so I feel like money and stability offers, they're coming in from all directions right here with the Seven of Cups. There's more than one option right here that I feel like could be giving you options right here concerning finances and money for some of you. It's more than one option to bring in finances and money. Okay, so here, please, for Leo. This is November 2023 for Leos, okay. Three of Swords. So I feel like some cycle's complete right here, you know, of heartbreak right here, so type of way. You know, you're going to get a beautiful new beginning now. Six of Swords right here. Because okay. I got the Six of Swords and the Six of Pentacles. So these two six make me feel like something is coming into balance right now for you. For some people here. Okay. Some of you, you could be traveling. For the Six of Swords, maybe you're traveling. Put your message here, please. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, Eight of Wands right here. Now, this is a card of communication and travel again. So, some of you, maybe you're traveling. I'm here with somebody saying, here, I miss you a lot. So I feel like somebody misses you right here, Leo. It's going to be a Taurus or Libra or somebody. Yeah, four of cups right here. I don't know if somebody missed the opportunity with you. If they did, I feel like they regret they missed the opportunity with you. If they did, because the four of cups could be a missed opportunity. So I'm sure somebody here. Feel like they lost you. The Empress right here could be somebody that creates it some way. In reverse, they might feel like they lost you. This could be a mother. Could be the fact right here that um you could be that twin flame. Could be the case too. But I'm I'm seeing that somebody feel like they lost you or something like that. Yeah, the Hermit could be a Virgo right here. The Hermit card right here. I feel like somebody's reflecting about you with the Hermit card. You know, I feel like somebody misses you. I feel right here. Could definitely be anybody at this point, but I feel like they miss you, okay? Yeah, three of cups right here. Yeah. For some of you, all right, I'm getting like you leaving somebody behind. Because either they had a third party, these two threes. Maybe they had a third party. If they had a third party, I feel like you're leaving them behind. Okay? They're heartbroken. Or you could be heartbroken. Somebody's heartbroken. Three of Swords is a heartache card. So somebody's heartbroken about the fact that you leave them behind. Or that they had a third party right here. Okay? This could be somebody that just sent with the Six of Swords right there. Okay? Yeah, they really feel like this is a loss. Ace of Pentacles reverse is something that's really stable. It's a loss. I feel somebody feel like they lost you. Okay, what's the message right here, please? Ace of Cups right here. I just feel like you made it real clear to somebody here that something is not moving forward in some way. Now, this could even be a house for some people here. Okay. I feel like somebody really felt that was wish fulfillment talking to you about a house or somebody's house is beautiful or something immaculate, something like that. What's going on? Okay. Judgment. Okay. This right here is, I'm hearing a wake up call, but it's a judgment right here that something's a missed opportunity in some way. Four, four cups is a missed opportunity card. I'm not sure what to do with a house or what, but. It's something's a missed opportunity right here. I feel like either you could be part of reviewing the summer head third party. You know, this is the thing about Leos, right? Now, I feel like you're a very confident individual, you know. When it comes down to love or things like that, you know what you want, right? So if somebody over here has a third party right here, you know, of course, yeah, I feel like in your energy. You're not going to stand for that. I don't feel like you're going to stand for that. You know what I'm saying? They have a third party, then the cycle complete here. But that don't mean it don't hurt like hell. 
I feel like it hurts right here for somebody here. If somebody had their point, I feel like that's heartbreaking to either to you or to them. You know, they had their price some cycles complete, I feel right here, you know. They had their pride and chose somebody else, you know, that's kind of heartbreaking, I feel. But at the same time, that's not something that you can stand for, for real, deep inside. That's not who you are. That's not even something that you want to stand for, I feel. So that was wishful thinking, and they heartbroken, I feel. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like somebody wasn't telling the truth. That's wishful thinking they're not going to tell the truth or miss the opportunity for you, with you for a third party or something like that, you know? I'm not sure if somebody here not telling the truth right here about a mother or something like that. They're not telling the truth about something like that. Yeah. Yeah, somebody's going to be really restricted. They're going to feel you, I feel. You know, bring the fire, all right? You want to have a third party, you choose a third party, you miss an opportunity with me, they're going to feel it, I feel, you know? And I just feel like you're like, dang, I never thought that um I would be saying these words or I never thought I would be doing this or something like that. What's that song um, Sierra sing? Oh, I can't think of it. She said, nah, 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 nah. She said, I, I wish I never was singing this song. I wish I never had to sing some song right here to somebody. They had third party. Unbelievable. Now they're going to feel something, something like that. They're going to be restricted or something like that. Some people here. I'm trying, I'm trying to think real quick what the name of that song. Can't think of it right now. Ten of Cups right here in the Wheel of Fortune right here. Something's fate. They're powerless. You know, when they contemplate about something, they're powerless right here. Or, you know, you feel powerless. Like, I can't deal with third party. Like, what? I'm powerless. It's a missed opportunity for them or something like that. It's a missed opportunity for them, I feel, yeah. Okay. Um... So I feel like that's definitely heartbreaking to you or to them. It affects them for some people right here. They're restricted from your energy. I feel like, you know, you had to cut somebody off and it hurt a little bit, I feel. It hurts them. It also hurt you, I feel, too. Because right. I feel like you like, I'm too faithful for all that. Like, what is they doing? Something like that. You know? So I'm kind of getting you a little. So let me see here. And for some people here, they was they was open up to you, so they're gonna feel a loss as well financially here. I feel for some people here, right? They might even feel a loss right here financially right here, two of swords. Okay, they stale me or whatever. No, that's not gonna work. I feel. Okay. Yeah, that's the name of the song. I bet you. Uh, I bet you start loving me as soon as I find someone else, something like that. That's an on the um the song by Sierra. I bet you start loving me as soon as I find somebody else or something like that. Right, yeah. Anything else here? And she was like, um, I really hate that I was singing there go. I really hate that I was singing this song. Right? Because all I wanted was you. Leo, 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 Leo. Mm, this could be a Taurus right here or um, a crazy Libra Gemini. You know? Or this even could be somebody you was married to or you was going to marry. Could be the case. Something like that. This even could be some truth right here about religion or something like that. Could be the case. Okay? But anyway, that's what I have here. I'm going to go ahead and end it right there. And I will do an extended version for you. Um, for the month of uh, November as well. Okay, so thank you so much for taking a look here, and I send you all peace, blessings, love, and light. Namaste to you.